Welcome to week five, Methods for Compliant Content Creation. Now that you have an understanding of universal design for learning and backward design, you will now learn about the most commonly used methods for creating compliant content from a more technical standpoint. At the beginning of this course, you learn the standards and guidelines you need to follow when using technology for teaching and learning. This week, we will review these standards in more detail and you'll complete an assignment implementing these standards. Don't worry, you don't need to be a technology expert to learn how to create content that is technically compliant. We will show you simple methods that anyone could use. We look forward to collaborating with you this week.